How flavorful is it? It is tasty like water. Good. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Beer Brothers Play No Man's Sky. I'm I'm Keith. <laughs> and I'm Bryson. I'm a little geek boy. If you haven't met us yet, welcome. Welcome, I'm a little metal-faced geek boy. Uh, Bryce is off the world. We tend to just kind of chat while we play, but we are in the same game. So, <laughs> sometimes we cross paths, sometimes we don't, you know. It, this, that's how it is. I have to go rare and fight. What oh, was that, Bryce? Is that a rare occasion? Yeah, rarely we'll go and hang out in each other's base. Um, I have to go destroy pirates. So, here we go. Mm-hmm. Gotta locate the pirate vessel. There he is. Am I just a hitman now? I'm a hitman Probably. out for blood. Mostly. There we go, we got it. Engage in attack ships. Ooh, yikes, they want my booty. Ooh, got him. One missile shot took them out. Yeah, the missiles ain't no joke. I feel like I would I do need to go and outfit my ship with some, some better weapons. But I don't really like this ship very much, except for its size, so. Got him. Got him. Return to the armor. That was easy. <laughs> Back to the pennant. No matter how hard I try to aim at my own base, I always end up flying down toward Aunt Jemima's booty kingdom. I do the exact opposite. <laughs> Landing. We did it. Oh. So what are you up to? Out, what are you doing out there, Bryce? What is, what's your goal in the world? I'll be honest. Right now, I'm just sitting here seeing if that exotic ship comes back. <laughs> Bryce, the last time missed his uh, missed his chance to buy an exotic ship that he really wants. Is it done? Have you purged the vile beings? Of course I have. You goof. To be young, to kill again. Grah, how I envy you. There's both good and bad news. They flood their wrath, but merely delays their righteous termination. Hunt them down, interrogate them for potential weapons technology, and then consign them to the Great Abyss. Sentinel Hunter Ibia, clearly possessed by the thrill of the hunt, but this energy cannot disguise the fact they appear to be weakening. Has residing here in my base caused them to become ill? The armor wishes for me to find one of the escape pirates and take any technology they might, they might possess. This is our prize, and a pirate to do with you, as you will, Grot, make your ancestors proud. Okay, I'm gonna let the armorer do his thing for now, I'm not really interested in armoring right now. I wanna keep upgrading the base. Let's talk to the overseer. Things are aligning, we're ready now for a Gek Farmer. Indeed, I've already prepared their contract. All you need to do is get the selenium required to finalize their work. Uh, he seeks again to expand my new home. I find it hard to disagree with them, for a farmer would open up a world of possibilities. Overseer needs selenium to compete, complete the agricultural terminal plans. Selenium grows on scorched planets and requires hazmat gauntlets to harvest. It's not easy to acquire in the wild, it only proves the value of recruiting a farmer. Okay. I do need to make a hazmat gauntlet. Chromatic metal and sodium nitrate. How do you get sodium nitrate? Uh, put sodium in a refinery or gotcha. mine it. It's like those big yellow crystals. Gotcha. I was thinking that I would probably just throw it in the refiner. Here we go. Now I'm looking for copper. 
I already used up that copper deposit. Let's go do a different copper deposit. Does paraffinium also turn into chromatic metal? I don't believe so. But gotcha. Cobalt and indium do. Gotcha. Cobalt and indium turned into four chromatic metal. Nice. Well, then I will likely be doing that instead. Which is why I like to go to Aunt Jemima's Indium Booty Palace and <laughs> mine activated indium off of a moon. You're saying that you go and mine activated indium off of Aunt Jemima's moon? Indeed. Mm. And quite a moon it is, friend. Quite a moon it is. A titan of a moon. Indeed. Just trying to take these resources. Just trying to take them. Take them good. I don't think I have any cobalt in my pack. I do actually. Well, what do you know? I'm always looking for copper, but really I can use cobalt. And I feel like you definitely told me that before. I just didn't let it sink in. Uh, I just said it. But I think you told me about the cobalt thing before. Oh, yeah, I have. Ended up. I'm really hoping I can add on to my to the base with like the wooden things. I really love to be able to put the farmer in like a, a wooden uh, base rather than rather than. Uh, this big round hole base. Cobalt, cobalt, doodly doodly doo. Bryce, when I put cobalt into the refiner, it becomes ionized cobalt. Oh, um. Maybe it's just indium. Hmm. Then. Or maybe it's ionized cobalt becomes chromatic metal. I don't know. Well, I just tried it's that and it goes back to cobalt. Indium, cadmium, emerald. Oh, yeah, that's what it was, yeah. Um, I'm about to head back there. I have some activated indium there, I believe. Oh, that's okay. I've got copper. I'm throwing it in right now. All right. No worries at all. Oh, I remember I put this big phallic shape coming out from the ground to show that uh, there was a cave down here. We are recording this video on a Tuesday, which means a new episode of Dungeon Boys comes out today. Hey. Bryce, are you That's enjoying Dungeon Boys? I am. I really am. I find that I am very critical of myself every time we finish recording, and I think of things that I should have said differently or revealed to you differently. But You're very critical of yourself when you go to the bathroom, Keith. Excuse me? Very critical, very, very critical of yourself in like every instance of your life. Oh yeah, okay, that is true. That's a problem of mine. That is true. I am hypercritical of myself. Indeed. But if I had to choose, I'd rather be hypercritical of myself than not care about anything I do. You know. Yeah. <sighs> A happy medium would be ideal. <laughs> Alright, I have the supplies to build a hazmat suit. Or hazmat gauntlet. Okay. So now I can get selenium. Now I need to remember where a fire planet is. Oh, goodness. Oh, man. A fire planet. 
I just want to be able to build vehicles, Bryce. Are you able to build vehicles yet? I don't know. <sighs> we gotta keep working. Gotta keep um, plugging. You can look through your discoveries to find a fire planet. Mm -hmm. Planet data. Infrequent blizzards, that's not a fire planet. Sweltering damp, not a fire planet. Ice storms, boiling super storms, still not a scorched planet. Blistering floods. Heat storms? Hmm. That's still not a scorching planet, is it? Boiling monsoons. Oof. Sterile. Caustic moisture. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Dehydrated. Permafrost. Uh, you should be able to look and see what elements are prominent there. Mm. Is selenium what I'm looking for to be prominent? Yeah. Oh, okay. Here's one. Lurag. I mean, selenium is what you need, right? Mm hmm. I need to go to Ulino. Ulino 15. I think that's the one I went to. Ulino 15. I'm coming to use your teleporter, big dog. Alright, I'm gonna shoot you. Don't shoot me now. No, good lord. Why are you shooting me from the sky? I see your explosions. Did I hit you at all? Yep. Nice. What's that feel like whenever I shoot at you? My ship is barely taking damage to its shield. Good. I was, I was worried that you were going to say my ship is barely functioning. <laughs> <laughs> you have literally destroyed it. It is impossible. Did, did, does, no, this is the same ship you had. I did not successfully purchase an exotic ship. Okay, let's go. To Bryce's teleporter room. Do do do. I'm gonna show you Bryce's teleporter room in this hobbit hole of a room back here. Let's do it. Bryce, I can't use your teleporter hole. You can't? No. Uh, can you? It's like. Yeah, I can use it. Rats. Um. Hang on, it's. Go make one. It's really cheap. Okay. And you just made ionized cobalt, didn't you? I have some. I can make some. Um, it is... What does it take to make one? We must make a teleporter. One ion battery and 50 ionized cobalt. And I happen to have an ion battery. I do not have one. Bryce, I don't think I can make a teleporter, friend. You sure? I don't think I have the ability. Look under your, it's your permanent technology things. Permanent technology. Like, like ah, your, Yes, uh, so I can, I can do it. Sorry. Alright. Um, hang on, I gotta give you a battery. Okay. If you keep running away, that will not happen. A uh, large refiner. Thank you, you Andrew Lima. Anytime. You're as sweet as that brown stuff I eat on my pancakes. Do you have any frost crystals by any chance? I don't. There was no. once a point where I searched high and low for frost crystals, but never found any. I need to farm some pure ferrite while I go on my way back. Oh, there's a hill. On a hill far away. Stug and Jemima's beauty palace. The end of suffering and shame. Did you leave already? Nope. I'm going to build my 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 drink my drink thing. Okay. Do not leave yet. I have a thing for you. Okay. I'm just going to build my teleporter outside.
cobalt. Put new cobalt. I have in. successfully made one living glass. Nice. Do the plants look cool when they're fully grown? Uh, it looks like a regular plant, and somebody copied and pasted a frost crystal to the top of it. Nice. <laughs> Same with the copperite flower. Nice. Waiting for that cobalt. I have not successfully grown one of those gamma root plants yet. But I just went to a planet that had gamma root and mm. harvested it. Hey, your front door closed. Not for me. <laughs> oh, you gave Check me living glass. Door. Why'd you give me the living glass? Because it's yours to have. All right. Be well, merry with. I will be very merry with it. Let's check Did it you out. Look at it. Five hundred sixty-six thousand units. Dang. <laughs> That's crazy. I like how like the benefit of it in game is nothing. <laughs> like it's essentially said, oh, it's co it's cooler glass. Maybe there's some crafting recipe that requires it. Permanent technology. Here we go. That's true. You're probably right. I shouldn't have shouldn't have jumped the gun. Okay, there's a teleporter at my front door now. Now I forgot where I'm trying to go. Um. Yulino X yep, bars. Yulino 15. Same thing. You got it. Oh, man. Bryce, will you call my work and say, Hey, my name is Johan Gustavo, and I have planted a bomb in the basement. And the only way it won't go off is if uh, they, they don't come to work today. Make sure you do it from your burner phone. Because I don't want to go to work. I want to stay home. I want to do hood rat stuff with my friends. On the computer, of course. Shailing is not where I want to go. Lurag, that's where I want to go. I believe. Dang, Lurag is so far away. <laughs> Come on, tell me about Lurag. Yep, selenium. That's what we want. Only a minute away. Now, where do you find selenium? It's in uh, those big solar vine plants. Gotcha. You'll see them. I assume. Gotcha. There's one... There was one planet I went to that was supposed to have selenium there, but it did not. Ooh. Would it be this planet I'm going to? <laughs> Would it be. That's gonna break my little heart. How about I break your face, fool? No, I'll break your face. Jimmy Neutron. What Good a, show. What a classic. My children may never know the joy of Jimmy Neutron. They will not. The way our, the way the land continues to go, uh, <laughs> my children may not know joy. Okay. <laughs> Truer words, my brother. That is not. That's not true. Never have they been speak. Bryce, it gave me so much pleasure. I went to see Granny Mae the other night. Granny Mae is what we call our grandmother. It's not the coolest grandma name. It doesn't it it doesn't I don't think it gives her enough credit, but it's it's what we got. Um, but it was it gave me so much pleasure and joy to listen to her talk crap about Donald Trump. Like this little old white lady is yes. talking mad, mad trash about Donald Trump. Talking about how he's a he's 
like a big liar and how he's taken away like he's he, he does wrong and he knows he does wrong but he gets up there and lies to us about it and how he's act, these tariffs are going to mess us up they're closing down factories in South Carolina and how I was like well maybe we'll get rid of him in two years and she says in two years I want him to impe- impeach him <laughs> I was like I don't I mean whether I agree or not I'm, I, I, I'm all about my grandmother breaking the stereotype of what she should be saying. Um, Granny May is a fairly cool name in the fact that literally everyone that knows her calls her that. Yeah, that's true. Alright, let's Whether talk to Selene. Whether she's their grandmother or not. Yeah. She's the whole community's grandmother. My boss calls her Granny May. <laughs> Say my name. <laughs> Where? All right, I see some green plants. Organic rock. I, I can get some chlorine from this organic rock. Organic rocks are pretty pricey, right? Let's think about selenium. I, tr I don't know how to find selenium is a problem. Just use your scanner thing and look for them little leaf thingies. Mm. I do not know, Sam I am. But it is time that we end this video, sadly, before we find yeah. any selenium. No! No! That's impossible! <laughs> but it is possible. Bryce, you have anything else you want to tell the folks before I kill you and end the video? Um. Please don't kill me. Don't let him kill me. It's, Does that okay. work? You succeeded. They, they, they stopped me. Okay. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you next time. Thanks so much Bye, for guys. watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, check us out, man. Watch Dungeon Boys. If you like this, if you like this, you'll definitely like D and D, right? <laughs> yeah, they're very similar. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. So come, 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 watch us play that. You get to see Bryce's face, his beard, him in all of all of his his grand form, mm -hmm. and we'll. I think I just found selenium. Hey. <laughs> But we'll see you in the next video, folks. Thank you so much. I love you very much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.